Hi, I'm Natanya Padachi, an endodontist from Victoria, Canada. Now, we all know that the purpose of root canal therapy is to eliminate infection and the agents that are distressing the pulp. Mechanical debridement of the canal is of primary importance, and we spend a lot of time perfecting our instrumentation techniques. But cleaning the canal space chemically is equally critical. And having a consistent technique that takes advantage of the latest technologies will lead to consistent results. Take a look at how sodium hypochlorite, Cumix 2-in-1 solution, and an endoactivator combine to effectively attack and eliminate debris from the root canal space, and with it, the sources of root canal problems. Prepare for patient use with a thorough review of literature, video demonstrations, and whenever possible, using practice blocks or extracted teeth to get a feel for the new equipment or material being used. Step 1. Bleach during instrumentation. Full strength bleach should be used with or between instruments to aid in debridement. It dissolves tissue and begins the process of killing bacteria. A syringe of bleach with a side vented pro rinse needle expresses the irrigant laterally into the canal to protect against extruding the material apically. Step 2. Activated bleach. The endo activator is used in conjunction with a final bleach cycle to debride and disinfect both the instrumented and untouched areas of the canal where instruments and inactivated solutions can't go. Attach the endo activator tip based on the size of the canal. Express bleach gently into the canal with the syringe and side vented needle. Place the endo activator tip into the canal no closer than two millimeters from working length. Depress the on-off switch to activate the solution. Hydronamically agitate the solution using a pumping action to move the activator in short 2 to 3 mm vertical strokes for 30 seconds. Use intracanal suction to remove loose debris. Repeat another 30 second agitation cycle with fresh bleach. Use sterile water or saline to rinse the canal and remove any remaining bleach. Step 3. Final Rinse because bleach alone can't remove the smear layer, Q-Mix as a final rinse after bleach effectively accomplishes the task, breaking down that smear layer, disinfecting the root canal, and opening plugged dentinal tubules. Q-Mix contains a powerful chelating agent to remove the inorganic smear layer and a potent antimicrobial agent to simultaneously kill bacteria embedded in and behind the smear layer. Q-Mix is gentler on dentin than traditional protocols and leaves the canal clean, the ideal condition for obturation and restorations. Shake or agitate the Q-Mix 2-in-1 container. Avoid creating excessive bubbles or foam inside the container. Fill a syringe with Q-Mix 2-in-1 and attach a pro-rinse irrigation needle to the syringe. Insert the needle into the canal being treated, no more than 2 millimeters from the apex. Express Q-Mix 2-in-1 into the canal and irrigate for 60 to 90 seconds. Suction Q-Mix 2-in-1. Done. Q-Mix removes smear layer, bacteria, and doubt in one easy step, clearing the way for a complete 3D fill.